Toys and Game, Transformer Collector and Festival Dealer. Welcome everyone. Uh, today we are going to go uh, do a review of 1987 Series 4 Decepticon 6-Changer. Uh, and this is, I have two of them right here, you can tell. Uh, both of them are complete. Uh, both of them got the um, hypersonic blasters. And let's take a look at uh, one of them. Uh, you know, the, the configuration is pretty cool. Cool colors and and uh, the design is very nicely done though. Uh, and then we got the wings right back here. Uh, so let's go ahead and um, transform uh, this uh, six changer into all uh, six mode. Well, obviously you got one right here, right? The robot mode. But let's go ahead and take these guns away. And then we'll open up this flap. The first one we'll change into is a wolf. So we'll open this right here. Uh, that's it down here. Close this flap back. And then we'll, uh, this right here. I'll move these arms down. Or Right here, and we'll back this way, and we'll just right here, and then the leg right here. We'll ram this way. We we'll keep these uh, toe right here for the wolf, and then um, actually let's move this right here out this way, and let's move the head out there. Okay, we have uh, this is this is the head of the wolf right here, and then now we'll move when back. Wing back. Okay, and then just move on down. All right, so here we have we have the wolf right here. Um, and if you want to put the gun, uh, put the gun right here. Uh, but the wolf doesn't get what he carry gun there. All right, so here we are. I'm gonna take shot back a little bit that way you can see the wolf. Uh, very cool. Um, very cool wolf right here. All right, so next one, what we'll do is we'll transform this into the car or carrier mode, I guess. So let's tell it take the gun away again. And obviously, we don't need the, the head anymore, so let's move the head back this way right here. Um, and the car, let me move the wings up here that way and get in the way. Um, Flaps in this way here. I'll leave the foot in there. There you go. It's snapping right in there. And we'll close this up right here. And for the call, um, you gotta. There's like a little lever right here though, you gotta have to adjust this a little bit. Move it in a little bit right here. Um, and then you gotta turn the wheels right here. And it's on the other side, there's like a little, I don't know what you exactly call it, but you have to adjust it though. So, uh, and then we'll have to turn these wheels. And then we'll turn this wheel right here. And, Okay, so, and then we'll move this down a little bit. Okay, so here we have, um, hmm. oh, there you go. There you go, we got the wheels on the car right here. Uh, and then on this side, same thing, we got the wheels on the car right here. And we'll go ahead and put these guns, guns on top of this right here. I'll move it back a little bit. So we'll put this gun right here, and we'll put the gun on this side right here. All right, so, oh, we got back a little bit. Back a little bit that we can see. Oh, actually, I'm gonna move this up closer, and yeah, we can see a better look at it. So this is the um, the armor carrier mode right here. All right, so what should we do next here? So let's go ahead and transform this into a Starfighter attack jet mode. All right, so let's go and take the gun away here. These wings out a little bit. Uh, that way it won't get in the way. Uh, we'll flip this out like this way. Uh, we'll flip. I'll we'll do just this way here again. And I'll we'll do just this way here. So let's, and then. Let's 
put the uh, captain over here and then you just like it. Okay, and then we just out this way that way you get more space to maneuver and then we'll close it. this right here. I like have to close this one first and then it snaps in right there. Okay, um, hmm, I think I might have got this. Okay, it should be this right here, so um, we'll have to turn this this way right here and then we'll be slowing down a little bit. And here we are, we have this in uh, jet mode here, so we'll attach the wings right here, I mean the, the weapon right here. And also we'll attach the weapon right here too. And also this one came off, so let's put it together again. Alright, so here we are. We have the, the jet mode right here. Oh, attack jet. Oh. So very cool looking design. Okay, so the next one we'll go with is going to be the, uh, the tank mode. The tank mode, um, a little bit harder to transform though. Because um, I just found it harder because there's one piece that had to be a little bit loose here. So we'll have to open this back up. And sometimes once you transform it, it gets really tight. There you go, it's fine with this right here. Um, so we'll, I know it's moving away. So. There you go. I want to change this right here. And change this right here. I'm moving them down a little bit. And here, we got a these are the same hump, tend to be very tight and then we use that over here. Oh, you know what? I gotta open this up. I want these flaps up. Now I have some space for the maneuver. And this is the part that I told you about. It's very tight. There you go. Uh, you know what? I should move this out of the way here. And that's what I was saying about this is very hard to move. Let uh, me shoot these flaps out from the back. No question why I'm doing it, Mike. There you go. Okay, very good. Okay. So now, there's the, we'll uh, move these guns out right here. Uh, let's see if you can see the guns right here. The, these guns. Are, I'll move this one out here first. And we'll move this one out here. There you go. Now we have the guns out right here. Now I'll do the pendants right here. There you go. And move this right here. These flap down. Um, there you go. These wind back out this way. Uh, this actually can go in or, or lift that up. There you go. And okay, I mean we got we got it in the um, the tank mode right here, and you can attach the gun right here. And also you can attach the gun right here too. Okay, so tank mode this right here. Uh, we'll turn this around so y'all can get a look at it. So you got one more though, one more to transform there. Okay, so we'll go ahead and do the um, jet propel laser uh, pistol mode. Okay, so let's go ahead and get these guns out of the way first. Okay, and then we'll stretch this out. We'll close these flaps. And I'll move this down right here. Oh, you know what? I've got one fin though for the for the um, for the uh, watchman call it. But, uh, 
Oh, let's move this back right, right here. I've got to move this back, move this up. Yeah, this is the only thing I've got to move up though. Now you have, it seems like you have uh, somebody sitting inside the tank there. So that's the easily forgot the transformation there. So let's go ahead and go, go back to what we were doing. Let's transform this into the pistol mold. And six shot was, um, six shot didn't want to appear in too many episodes. As a matter of fact, it was only in one episode of the Transformer cartoon though. And then we'll have to move this down here. Let's look like, maybe like a level. To, like this, okay, so, and then we'll move this this way right here. And something right here, we'll, we'll, we'll take this right here. Now we have uh, laser pistol mode, and then we'll attach the gun on this side right here. And we'll put the other side, and we'll attach the gun right here. And we've... Okay, I think we got it. Uh, we got them. Oh, you know what? I've got to do one thing. I've got to rotate this right here. Okay, I think, yep, I think we got it though. We got them in the, the laser pistol mode right here. And this is the level again right here. So, I mean, obviously it doesn't like making any sound because it does not have a battery in there. But very cool looking design. Six Shot was one of my favorite when I was little. But unfortunately, my parents didn't have the money to buy me any Transformers. So these, both these Six Shot that like you see, they're both second hand. They were not mine originally when I was a child. Um, well, I hope you like the content. If you do like the content, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you uh, next week. Thank you for watching. Bye.